Ruski Ed here, with a lesson about sight. Attempt to translate these sample sentences to Russian, and feel free to use the pause button if you need more time. If you want to learn Russian, but your time's not abundant, and the books you see are way too redundant, then sit yourself down and get ready to go. Stay tuned, cause it's time for the Ruski Ed show. The four words we will use in the translations for this lesson include Zralishi, which means sight, Zreniyi, which means vision, Vid, which means view, and Miesto, which means sight or place. So let's get straight to sample sentence number one now. It was not a pretty sight. First of all, Priyatni and Nye Priyatni are adjectives that could be used as part of this translation. But the key word is sight, and in this case, Zralishi is the best word for sight. The meanings for Zralishi include sight, spectacle, or show, by the way. Using these words, a couple good translations are Zralishi Bwilo Nye Iz Priyatnich and Eta Bwilo Nye Priyatnoyi Zralishi. The second sample sentence goes like this. No buildings were in sight. The word Zadaniyi means building, of course, and the phrase Nye Edinova means not a single. Also, the phrase Poli Zreniya means field of vision, with Zreniyi meaning sight, eyesight, or vision. Combining these words and phrases, a good translation goes like this. Vpoli zrenia nie buelo ni edinova zedania. Sample sentence three is as follows. His sight is deteriorating. Here we can use zrenii and we have a couple reasonable choices for deteriorating. On the one hand, uhuchacha, which can mean to become worse or to deteriorate, would work. And on the other hand, portitia, which can mean to deteriorate, to spoil, or to decay, would also work. So using these words we get, yevo zrenii uhuchayetsia, and Yevo Zreniyi Portitia. Moving along, we have sample sentence number four. She can't stand the sight of blood. We can use Vui Nasit, which can mean to endure or to stand as the main verb in the sentence. The word for blood is Krof, and Vid means sight or view. Applying these words, we get Anat Ne Vui Nasi Vida Krovi. And finally, we have We visited the site of the accident. For sight, we can use Miesto, which can mean place, position, or site. One word that might work for accident is prohis shesvii, which means incident, event, or occurrence. Another word with a similar meaning is sluchai. In fact, when sluchai is used with neschasni, which means unhappy or unlucky, we get the phrase neschasni sluchai, which pretty much means accident. In any case, the following translations will work. Mui posyeteli miesto prohis shesvia, and mui buili na miesti neschasnovo sluchaya. And now for two quick bonus sentences. She faints at the sight of blood. Anat padayat amorak pri vidi krovi. And I can't stand the sight of him. Ya ivo na duh nye peri nashu. The focus words for this lesson include zrelishi, which means sight, zreniyi, which means vision, uhutshatya, which means to deteriorate, vi, which means you, and miesto, which means sight. Ruskiad, signing out now. Das Vilanya! You made it to the end of the lesson, and watching Ruski Ed is better than guessing. The more you learn, the more you know. Come back for the next Ruski Ed show.